Thanks for joining us. I'm Chris McKinnon with the WBZ News Update. Our top stories today, a Methuen man is in custody after a standoff with police and SWAT teams. Authorities say the man was wanted for stealing a dog and a robbery in New Hampshire. Several neighbors had to be evacuated during the hours-long standoff. Police say the suspect, 38-year-old Stephen O'Neill, refused to respond to officer negotiations. Eventually, officers went in and found O'Neill hiding in the attic. They also discovered a shotgun and other weapons. Methuen's police chief says O'Neill's family said he's had a recent issue of mental illness. Two firefighters were hurt while rescuing people from a burning Salem, New Hampshire building. It started this morning around 5.30. The Main Street building was home to a Chinese restaurant and 10 apartments. Everyone inside was able to make it out safely. The fire was so destructive, the building eventually collapsed. The firefighters were taken to the hospital as a precaution. A Ferrari driver facing charges after getting his sports car wedged under an SUV. Weymouth police say the driver was speeding and lost control when he shifted gears. The Ferrari crossed into oncoming traffic, went over a sidewalk and through a fence before landing underneath that SUV. A record crew had to hoist both vehicles from the scene. Now let's get a check on the forecast with meteorologist David Epstein. Hey, Dave. Hello, Chris. Uh, we have a nice afternoon, but a couple of showers around. Feels a bit muggy, and most of those showers will be confined actually in northern or southern parts of southern New England. I think greater Boston probably mostly dry. The humidity goes down tomorrow. The sun returns. It's a warm, dry weekend ahead, and we could really heat up. As a matter of fact, I think there's a very high likelihood we're going to be 90 either Sunday and or Monday. So before that happens, a nice couple of evenings, Friday and Saturday, for that Zach Brown Band concert at Fenway. And you can see the temperature trend, really, the, these Thursday, Friday, and even Saturday, very dry. Humidity starts to come back late Sunday, and by Monday, it's going to feel a bit sultry out there with temperatures approaching the lower 90s. Here's the radar forecast, and notice the showers, if you get one, they move through really fast. A couple of clouds and maybe a sprinkle in the wee hours of the morning, but for the most part, when you get up tomorrow, the earliest sunrise of the year is tomorrow, by the way. It looks fantastic. So let me step out of the way and look at that seven-day forecast. We've got that sprinkle today or a brief shower. Tomorrow, partly sunny skies, breezy, low humidity. Friday's gorgeous. Saturday and Sunday, looking like a terrific weekend. Dad should be happy. Chris? All right. Thank you very much. I'm Chris McKinnon. This has been a WBZ News Update. Have a great day.